guys, welcome to Berkman Mitsubishi. My name is CJ, and you're joining me today for another walking around video. Today, I've got a, a 2017 Suzuki Vitara wagon model. So, in this video, guys, let's have a look of this beautiful car inside the outside and some of the key features you get with it. So, I'll start from the bonnet, smaller wagon model, compact SUV, got white color. Uh, paintwork on the body looks beautiful uh, you have got your headlamps there your daylight running lamp and your fog lamps on the front bumper on the center grill you get your iconic uh, Suzuki um, logo in it as well just come around beautiful black genuine um, Suzuki alloy wheels as well we're gonna have a thorough closer look in a minute but let's keep going you can see there's black garnish around the um, the whole car around the whole car at the bottom edge as well so on the side you can see your side indicator on the front guard and you got your side mirrors with the body color door handles are also coming in the body color as well also you do have got roof rails and roof cross um, bars on this car as an aftermarket product as well. Coming to the back of the car guys, you've got your uh, rear wiper mounted the rear window. Rear view camera, Suzuki logo and the Vitara logo, the two chrome finished badges. That's the rear view. Coming to the side, the driver's side, let's keep a close eye, looks pretty good, alright beautiful, now we're going to have a quick closer look of these alloy wheels, so they're um, black finish, genuine Suzuki alloy wheels, i jump onto the next one, pretty clean, well kept, well looked after, can't see any scuffs or damages on it. Your third alloy wheel, the driver's side rear, and your last alloy wheel, oh, sorry, the passenger side rear and the passenger side front. Alright, so you can see the condition of exterior is near brand immaculate condition for a used car guys. There are no cosmetic damages on the body or the alloy wheels. So what I'm going to do now is I'm going to jump in at the, um, in the inside interior. Let's have a look at um, the interior of the car. So inside, so we start from the door. So you get on the door panel, vinyl finish with a bit of a uh, cloth trim finish there. And a silvery colour insert and a chrome door handles. Two-tone cloth trim seating inside the car and a genuine Suzuki Vitara um, carpet matic already added to the car as well. Alright, on the dashboard, again it's a vinyl finish. Again you get another um, insert for the aesthetic look, the design, which goes around your center display and halfway um, in your um, dashboard as well. Front fence. The round shape. You got a manual um, clock as well, analog clock, and your center display. We're gonna have a thorough look at this center display, checking out what you're gonna get, what you can access through this center display um, when I jump on the driver's side as well. What I'm gonna do, we'll pop the. There you go. So you get underneath. You'd get your. Um, has a lamp key and then you have got your um, climate controlling knobs and the buttons and there is a little bit of a space down there as well and if you can see there pretty hard to see what I might do there you are that there you get a 12 volt power socket there and a USB port right there Beautiful. All right. 
So, next thing you'd come across is your standard gear knob. And then you have got the smallest um, storage space, two bottle holders, and your center console. So inside the center console, you can see it's a pretty, pretty deep center console there for your storage purpose as well. Let's turn the light off. All right, interior, the condition wise, the interior of this car so far at the front looks amazing. Immaculate condition, near brand new guys, no damages and uh, no worn outs or no stains. Also, super comfy to be seated in these seats as well. Next thing would be, let's jump inside the back row, second row seating. Let's see what you get in this car when you are a rear passenger. Again, super comfy. Generous amount of space and leg space from my knee to the seat. If you could see, that is that is pretty generous for a compact small SUV. Three three seats facing again at the back row, and you get the isofix points for the um, baby seats or child seats as well. All right, beautiful. Looks pretty good so far. So the last thing, I'm going to take you to the cargo area. All right, let's pop this boot up. All right, beautiful. Now, I'll start from the inside, guys. Now, with this lighting, it's a bit dark at the moment, but you get one, two, and three anchor points so if you have got child seats which needs anchor points instead of the isofix this car can accommodate that too also has got a, a cargo color so that's solely for the privacy of your personal belongings if you have parked your car in a um, in a public area in a public place on the roadside if you have got your personal belongings if you don't want people to just peek through I would always encourage have your cargo cover always on also you can remove your cargo cover super easy as well that's how easy you can take it off and remove it from the car too if you'd like always better to be safe than sorry so what i'll do oh, just get this right yep there you are Beautiful. Pop my side up. And get the pop the other side up. Alright. Underneath the cargo, the mat, you get your space saver spare wheel with the jacket as well. Pretty good. Pop this down. So for a small, smaller compact SUV, you can see there's a generous amount of cargo space in this car in the boot as well. So, drop it down. Most exciting part, I would say, we're coming to the driver's cockpit. So, standard features on the door side, um, the driver's door side handle. You get um, the power window buttons, window lock key, and unlock. Uh, central locking and locking and the mirror adjusters So it's got the standard It's got the standard key start and I'm gonna have to have the lights again so I can show you the multi-functional steering wheel Beauty on your right hand side guys you get your cruise control setup speed limiter and your left hand side you get the mode that you can choose on your center display as i'm pressing you can see each click gives me different options and then the mute button volume up and down and the direction keys so you can flick through your stair um your radio station at the moment it's on fm radio 
that right there you have got your voice recognition please say a command you can say phone navigation or media you can also say commands like call followed by a number or name address followed by an address or play followed by an artist or album name wait for the beep to say a command pending speech rec Let's just leave it that so you can see it actually lets you access to your voice uh, voice recognition button and you got your phone answering and phone hang up as well. Coming to the center display, we've got the home beat, home key. So you get your AM radio. Um, hang on a second. So at the moment it's on your AM radio. You can access your phone through there, smartphone, uh, no smartphone linked at the moment, that's your Bluetooth, and that's your um, inbuilt sat nav. That's the phone. All right, so your source selection, you can choose FM1, FM2, um, FM ASD, AM and AMSD as well, so other medias, that you can choose are Bluetooth, USB, SD card, and iPod as well. Also, the setup display would allow you to get it's pretty with the lighting I'm getting. It's pretty hard to show you at the moment. Just that's your. Uh, rear view camera vision at the moment but with the right lighting you get a really super clear view at the moment it's, big, it's, it's dark and this is just glowing on my um, camera lens I'm trying to get a better angle that right there probably would be the best I can show you at the moment but in the daytime if I had recorded this video you'd get a like a super clear um, high definition view to this camera so that's for your drive at this beautiful now that's pretty much it guys considering like all these key features that we can see the um, aftermarket accessories the condition of the interior and exterior now if you are interested in such a beautiful car that you're looking for as your next perfect car matching this car give us a call do not wait too long give us a call write this number down it's not uh, double nine or seven or triple five or you can come to our dealership. It's located at uh, 20 to 32 on Kangan Drive in Berwick. We are Berwick Mitsubishi. Um, I myself or any of my colleagues, matter of fact, that's my good mate who's working with me, Tommy. <laughs> Ourselves, we can give you a hand to find you the next perfect car you're looking for, guys. Do not wait too long, come to us. Also, if you're looking for finance options when you're planning to purchase your next perfect car we have got in-house finance it's easy fast and convenient for our customers so do not wait too long guys give us a call double nine or seven or triple five or come to our dealership at 2032 on kangan drive in berry now that's it for the 2017 suzuki vitara walking around video i'll catch you in the next video